Welcome back to another draft. We're going kill time again. So let's let's see how it goes this time around. Last time it went okay, I guess, for the first kind of draft or second draft of kill time. Like we went free free. The only issue I have with kill time is so slow format. Like so let's see if we can draft like a aggro deck this time around or something like that. That will be more fun, I guess, than the grindy snow deck. That we drafted last time. Two people not raiding up this time around. It's usually only one person, though. And the last person. Survey says... Yes, no, maybe so. Doesn't seem like it. Back to the queue. Hey, everybody ready it instant. Nice. Okay, what is this? Add one color, other legendaries, blah blah blah. Beginning of reveal the color of the library. Oh my god, I'm not going five colors again. So, the best card here is Packmate. I thought it was called Packwolf. Oh, it's Packmate. Oi, mate. <clears throat> we could also go the aggro route, which is probably more. Actually, should we try and go aggro instead? I said I was tired of like grindy matches. So let's go aggro. And see how it goes. Like we can do some boasts. Stuff. Like pack mate is definitely the right pick in this pack. Or oh, ice bind pillar. Which is just a uh, icy manipulator for this set. But let's go aggro. So in aggro, I guess this card is pretty good. Like we met it last time, we did it, where kind of got blown out by the double strike thing. But it should also be a card that is wielding, right? I think maybe Bounding Gold is the better option here. Or the Tuskery Firewalker, but we're probably gonna see some more of those guys. I'm just gonna take the Bounding Gold here. What is this? Earns us a battlefield of search, five for rune card. Okay. Taking the, the removal here. So here we got some treasures, such a library for name, bub, or an equipment. It's also just a frostbite here, which I'd rather take. Artifact and shaman spells, your cards cost one less. That's also pretty decent. But again, frostbite is removal, so I'm gonna pick removal over anything at the start. And now I'm a pack hogger, so I better send some cards forward. Um, in the battlefield, draw a card, discard a card, cannot be bad. Right? Like, it fixes our lands, like if we get too many lands we can discard them and draw a new one. If we don't get that many lands we can discard something we don't need and get, try and find some lands. Seems pretty good for aggro. And we can get another one. Don't see anything else I want. Let's just pick it. Seems like white is kinda taken, but black is really open. So let's take a feed the serpent because black apparently seems really really open. And I'm okay with taking black red instead. Here we get a Nestle Battlefield and the next turn creature you can attack if able whenever an attacking creature controller. Whenever an attacking creature dies, each opponent okay. Yeah, sure. 
Um, not going the snow route. So I'd rather have the skull raid. It's card draw and it's uh, like card removal. Here we got the dwarf. Oh, this is our pack again. So we cannot do this card. We can either do this guy or this one. So do we want the dwarves or do we want the berserker? I think we want the berserker. How many two drops do I have? I have three two drops? Need a lot of two drops. This is also three drops. I really have the three drop because you can use it on two and get it on three. Got this guy back, which is nice. There's also... Uh, don't mind taking one or two of these guys. It's good for attacking. Or the pump. Right now, I'm gonna focus on the creatures. Gonna take this one for our sideboard. Uh, exile a creature card from your graveyard target opponent. Actually, there's a Faithful here. Faithful is pretty decent. Let's us regain some HP. And we drafted too quick. Now we just have to sit and wait. Ah, some card selection and a treasure, maybe. Like it's not, I'd rather have more of these guys than this one, because this has a body to it. And we don't really need the treasures. This guy's fine. So I feel like we found the right, like, route to take. Rally the ranks again. Also had that one in one of my other packs last time around. Another pack mate. We could have two pack mates. Uh, return type creature from graveyard to your hand. Return two type creature cast as your creature type from graveyard to your hand. How I many? So we have demon, elf, dwarf, human. Got a ton of the circus actually. Uh, yeah, don't mind one of those. This one is the counter to our deck, so we're not gonna pick that one. Did we take the dwarfs? We actually. You know what? I think this card is gonna wheel. I'm gonna take the dwarf tokens instead. And I wouldn't mind finding like some equipments. I don't like the tap line since we're going aggro. So I'd rather stay away from that. Even though it is fixing. But it's tap fixing, so it doesn't really help. Ah, da -da 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 -da. See, here's one of the equipments. One plus one. No, that is not. I thought it was. Need the animated equipments. Those are OP AF. So it gives one plus one. Whenever equipped creature becomes blocked, it deals one damage to defending player. Uh, I don't know. It seems okay, but I don't know if this is the deck for it. I think I'd rather take the Disciple here for now and then wield one of these two. Because the cyborg is a body and it's a, a removal. So it's a two for one. If it gets good. Otherwise it's just a pawn of this card to card and it gets to jump block. Okay, we got a little frostbite here. Easy pick. That's also a Berserker we can hope to wheel. So if we get some Berserkers, we need to start taking the, the equipments and auras and pump spells. Oh, that guy doesn't have any packs, so here you go. Something to do while waiting. Another Frostbite, okay. I hereby don't need any more Frostbites. Return to a creature card from the Guerrero to the battlefield. Yeah, it doesn't really that good. Four till four, yeah. Not gonna happen. Burr, 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 burr. 
so here's a combat trick. Do I want a combat trick or do I want a creature? Maybe we actually just want the combat trick for now. Like it's a good combat trick. That like revives our creature. What is this? Other dwarf you control get one plus oh. One other dwarf you can whenever you control oh, whenever a dwarf you control becomes tap, create a treasure. Sacrifice treasures. How many dwarfs do I have? I have one, two, three, four. And she's a 2-1. I guess she's fine. There's a Dwarf Rogue here too. So here, do we take more Dwarfs or do we take another one of these? I think we take some more of the Dwarfs. Okay, okay, okay. I don't need any more. But I'm gonna take it anyway just to show that red is occupied. With a crown doesn't seem too good. Don't mind another skull raid. This is our starting pack. So here we got the rice again. Like the rice cannot be that bad. One of them is seems fine. Here we're gonna take the helm, I guess. Uh nothing we want from this pack, so we're just gonna take the giant. To get people of our colors, colorless. I would love some. The last two cards would be lovely if they were like free drops. There's a one one here. Also the circle. Maybe a maybe card. I feel like a one two for one that can, like life tap. Demonic. Okay. Two, uh, two pack deck. Another frostbite. Um, I'm not just going to rat draft here. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, do I want a fourth frostbite? What do we cut for fourth? Oh, we have four of these guys too. Okay. Yeah, I don't need it. Uh, enters the battlefield, choose one each from number of creature type in common. Gain X life. I think another raider here. Like, the raider seems really good. And we can cut something for it, definitely. Feed the serpent. There's also the land here. But I think feed the serpent is better. Another raider. There's also another disciple. I think I'm gonna cut this one for sure. Like we don't need the equipments. I also think I'm gonna cut a frostbite. Mm. Here we got another Berserker. Also, also way down. Like we have four removal cards or two hard removal. What is this? Copies a spell. It's not that great. Like we can just take the Berserker, but I don't think we're gonna use it. What is this counter target spell? Choose one, two, three at random. It's controller mills that many cards, then exiles the top of the library until they find different name spell they may cast without paying his mana cost. Meh. Another disciple. 
What else? We're just gonna pick motorcycles. So if we see the land now, like the uh, the used land, gonna pick it. How many dwarfs do we have? Of one, two. Maybe we cut this guy. No, we need three drops. What does this deal? Four damage to take creature planeswalker. For each, like it's four mana deal four, or three mana deal four. Maybe we don't need the rice. And a bolt. The bolt is also really nice. Oh, too many good playables. Actually, we can go like... Um, we don't need to have 17 lands on this deck, right? We can go like greedy mode and have like 15 lands. I feel like that's okay. Like, oh, most expensive card costing four. Ah, uh, let's take the pup here. We did not wield the land as far as I can see. Nope. So hopefully the draft is going to be fast this time around. Like we either lose fast or win fast. Yeah, seems like a decent deck. So many frostbites. But I think we have too many. Actually, how many creatures do we have? We have 12 creatures. Okay, we actually need some more creatures in the deck. Since we're playing aggro. Am I really good? Yeah, we don't. Oh, so many frostbites. I'm gonna cut a frostbite. And we're gonna put in one of these guys. And go like so. Just feels bad to cut frostbite. Like it's a shock. Only two creatures though. Yeah, it's fine. Let's uh, let's put on some sleeves. I'll take, uh, what's it called? City of Brass, but something like that. And add some lands. Seven of these. And eight of these. And let's get some wins in, hopefully. Seems fine. Not too aggro though. If we draw a land next time, we can make four dwarfs. Seems pretty good. Oh, he's three colors? Okay.
Exile from the graveyard. Skull wreck. Okay. Not skull wreck. Skull raid. I mean. Do we wanna attack? Uh, no, we don't. So next turn we can try and attack with our radar and use the gift. Okay, now he's going to attack. Then we can start attacking too. That bird kind of hoses me. Oh, nice. It's just me, is it a bit too loud? I think it is. Ha! <laughs> Funny. We keep our land in our hand for the radar. If we draw another one. Valkyrie Defeat the serpent doesn't do much sadly though Am I dead? No, I'm not. It's close. No, I am dead. Never mind. Okay. Forgot he had two flyers. Other than the equipment. Well, not a good first showing, but had a pretty slow hands for our deck. Let's try again. Damn, that's all the land we need. So, if we draw any other land, okay, we're dead. Just gonna play the Liberator here. Start pumping out dudes if he doesn't do anything. Does okay, that's an awkward one for me. Have <laughs> one free the hoser. Um, here we're just gonna spend our mana. It's usually the right choice to do. Doesn't have any snow lines though, so I cannot use it yet. Oh, he has a snow line. Let's use the ability. 
Oh, I cannot even play it. Okay. Fun times. Uh, let's just put Till here. So if I played a land, I could just have removed it. Sadly though. But if it was a land, I could have played it. So it's like 50-50. And we got the worm. Let's play this guy. Discard a land. Draw a card. Play this guy. Seems like we're losing this one too. Maybe this format is too slow for an aggro deck. Like, the big creatures are so big. Okay, time to flood the board, I guess. And now it has flying. Nice. <laughs> Like, he could make his snow lion a creature, right? On attack with it, too. Yep. Definitely going to block here. Uh, not what we were hoping for, and it's conceded. Uh, not the best showing for aggro. Like, the one free hoser. But you live and you learn. Let's see if we at least can get one win in. Okay, we gotta turn one, turn two, and turn three. That cannot be that bad, right? Like, this should be able to do something. Like, we can even save the best one. Follow turn four. Oops, this one. That's fine. Making him this card seems pretty good here. What 
Do they discard? Disdainful stroke, yeah, that's definitely the right discard power deck. For show. Icy manipulator. What? Okay. But he doesn't have any snow lands. Awkward. So here I'm actually just going to attack with this one. Activate it. And uh, for till this card here. Oh, there we go, a snow land. Tapping down, making a token. Gonna take his last two cards. And hotel. And no attacks. So what did I get? Okay, a seven drop. You go ahead and make some dwarfs. I'm gonna make some dwarfs too. Does he need lands, maybe? Because I definitely don't. Oh, it's a sorcery. That's kinda... kinda weak. Okay, he's tapping that card, it's fine. He's gonna keep the land in our hand. For this card and for our uh, like cycle. Let's just try to draw a card, then you reveal a giant from your hand. Deal two, the next giant, okay. Do we have lethal next turn? If we tap this, we have... Yeah, we do, we have exact lethal, if it doesn't do anything else. But let's go for it next turn. 
Oh, we also got a frostbite. That's nice. Exactly. Way. Managed to get one win at least. Let's see if we can get two. Are we able to get two wins with this deck? Don't have a one drop. Oh, don't don't really have a two drop either. But whatever. Patel. Till two. Gonna drop down the Sauger. What is this? When we cast a second spell? Oh god. That seems problematic. Let's attack and see what happens. Like we have to go with the aggro plan here. Sure. Just to life, yeah. Resolve. Got another one, sure. Damn, he has a board now. Oh, another land. Just have to go with the aggro plan here. See what he does. There's not much else to do. So we're gonna gift and gift. So you milled lands and I milled all my acro stuff. Lands, uh, we can attack with everything here. Yeah. 
kind of have to keep applying pressure. Oh my god, all my removal is gone, so... I'm probably just gonna keep getting lands. Now it dies and makes a 1-1. One, one. Nice. And we keep drawing lands. So we have how many lands left? We have 8. So we have 7 lands left in the deck. That's nice. Oh my god. One. There's only one land and they will only mill one land. Wow. No blocks. Yep. Seems good. Keep drawing lands. So I have one, eight. Nine, ten lands, so there's five lands left in our deck. No blocks. Like, we just have to go for the winning gameplay here. Oh, this is not winning gameplay. This is a loss, right? Yeah. Rip. Didn't go too far with this deck. So now we know that aggro kind of sucks. But now I learned at least. Claim the reward. One pack. And we get a mythic rare. Okay. Well, thanks for watching. Sadly, it didn't go too well, but hey, shit happens. Uh, I will probably upload like one video a week of drafting. Not gonna upload more because I don't think Kelheim is that fun of a draft format compared to like the Sunday car. But uh, and I've seen like Time Spiral is uh, is not gonna be standard, so hopefully they do some sort of Phantom drafting, or Premier drafting, whatever they call it in here. Definitely not gonna go over to Magic Online to like draft uh, Time Spiral. So hopefully they do some sort of Phantom draft for arena yeah but thanks for watching and i hope you have a nice day